Yo, 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 America and the world. My YouTube statistics say my highest viewers are from America, Singapore, Canada, UK, and India. So, not necessarily in that order, but greetings. Greetings, people. Um, let's see, in Varanasi, head to Lucknow today, then I'll be in Delhi, then Dubai, Oman, and South Africa for the month of July. I'm alive. This is a good thing. <clears throat> um, let's see, cool story, been in Varanasi for a week. Um, I'll show you, uh, Shub is in the corner finishing his shower around the deck. I'd show you him now, but he's still in his underwear. Uh, he looks good though. That's the beautiful thing about India. Nudity is a no-go in public, but that's the same in America. But showering on the rooftop in your underwear is perfect. Any, anyways. <laughs> this is not good. This is not good, yeah. as they say. Um, anyways, I've been able to speak at a couple of their, their house churches, um, which was good, man. I just felt like I... Felt like I nailed it. Uh, one day I felt really good. The other day I felt like, well, the power went out and I couldn't see their faces, so I was talking in the dark. So I kind of felt like a disconnect, but maybe there just literally was a disconnect. But uh, yesterday, I spoke at the church, probably three, three hundred people or so, and so that was good, man. I wasn't even worried, just wasn't even nervous. Just got up there and and shared my story in India and talked about just sonship and how, how all God wants to do is hang out with us and and just be with us and out of that like the John 15 says uh, the John 15 just hang out with me and you'll bear a lot of fruit and a lot of cool stuff will happen so shared that and uh, it's been cool each each time uh, every every meeting just taking some time to pray for people and seeing people get healed at the meeting the other day uh, this older lady had pain all in her arm and in her neck, and I think it had been there for for a couple years. Um, just praying with her and seeing all the pain leave her arm and seeing her be able to raise her arm and move it around uh, without pain, and pain left her neck. Um, let's see, one, a couple, one lady stood up after we prayed and said she had pain all in her body and it was totally gone, and one of the moms, uh, the mom and dad had like dizziness spells and... Uh, prayed for the mom and and all the all the dizziness and stuff left her and yesterday at church uh, prayed for this this guy that had he needed an ultrasound he had some like urinary stuff going on not sure uh, but I think his kidneys were or having issues or something but prayed for him and the pain left his back on both sides and uh, looks like he was doing good so it's just cool each time just praying for people and most of the time, seeing it all go, maybe a little bit is left, uh, but that's a lot of fun. Um, been spending time with uh, with Pawan and Anu, their family here, and Michael, their son, is hilarious, a little tyrant, uh, but he's so funny. Just he's always so he'll turn on the automated music to on the piano and he'll start dancing. Um, and today he was dancing on the mattress, saying Yahoo, and then. The next second he's crying and then laughing. Slightly schizophrenic, but I think that's two-year-olds. They're crying and laughing all in the same breath. Uh, it's beautiful. Um, so, boom, bam. Head to luck now. Just thought I'd check in. Peace.